Assalam o Alaikum friends welcome to my youtube channel medical laboratory world in this video I am share some MCQs in biochemistry ok let's start first one one of the following test is not a liver function test option a urea option b alkaline phosphatase option c total protein option d bilirubin correct answer Option A urea which is a kidney function test. Next one. In sickle cell anemia. In sickle cell anemia. Option A glutamic acid is replaced by valine at the sixth position of the alpha chain. Option B glutamic acid is replaced by valine at ninth position in the beta chain. Option C. Glutamic acid is replaced by valine at the sixth position of beta chain. Next. Option D. Valine is replaced by glutamic acid at the sixth position in the beta chain. Correct answer. Option C. Glutamic acid is replaced by valine. At the sixth position in the beta chain. Okay. Next one. Blood cholesterol level decreased in. Blood cholesterol level decreased in. Option A. Diabetes mellitus. Option B. Hyperthyroidism. Option C. Atherosclerosis. Option D. Hypothyroidism. Correct answer option B hyperthyroidism. In hyperthyroidism, blood cholesterol level is may be decreased. Next one. Condition in which bilirubin appears in urine. Condition in which bilirubin appears in urine. Option A hemolytic jaundice. Option B obstructive jaundice. Option C prehepatic jaundice. Option D none of the above. Correct answer. Option D. Obstructive jaundice. Okay. Next one. Anticoagulant used in the collection of blood for coagulation studies. Anticoagulant used in the collection of blood for coagulation studies. Option A. Potassium oxalate. Option B. Heparin. Option C. EDTA. Option D. Sodium citrate. Correct answer. Option C. Sodium citrate is light blue cap which is used for the anticoagulant uh, for the coagulation studies. Also sodium citrate used in the uh, study of ESR but usually 1 is to 4 blood and uh, anticoagulant ratio is 4 is to 1. But in coagulation studies. 1 is to 9 ratio used. 1 is to 9 ratio. Anticoagulant blood ratio is 1 is to 9. Okay, next one. What is the end product of protein metabolism? Option A, urea. B, uric acid. Option C, bilirubin. Option C, creatinine. Correct answer, option A, urea. End product of protein metabolism is urea. Uric acid is the end product of purine and also bilirubin is the red cells. Okay, next one. What is the method by which creatinine is estimated? Option A. Lieberman-Buchard reaction. Option B. Berthelot reaction. Option C. Jaff reaction. Option D. carr fries reaction. Correct answer. Option C. Jaff reaction. Next one. Benz Jones protein urea seen in. Option A. Nephrotic syndrome. Option C, multiple myeloma. Option C, infectious mononucleosis. And option D, acute immunodeficiency syndrome. Correct answer. Option B, multiple myeloma. Benz Jones protein present in multiple myeloma. Next question. 
normal value of serum potassium. Option A 3.5 to 5.4 milliequivalents per liter. Option B 2.5 to 3.5 milliequivalents per liter. Option C 5.5 to 8 milliequivalents per liter. Option D 136 to 145 milliequivalents per liter. Correct answer option A 3.5 to 5.4 milliequivalents per liter. 136 to 145 milli equivalents per liter is the normal value of sodium in serum. Okay. If you like the video, please like and share my video. Thank you.